that was conducted by ESPN Brazil, which has caused a bit of a hoo-ha. The reason, well, people are asked to name the best Brazilian player since Pele. Uh, they compiled a top ten. Neymar not in that Ooh. ten. Uh, Ronaldo, Ronaldinho, Romario making up the top three. Uh, Gab, is this unfair on Neymar? It's a bit harsh when you figure that, that he's outside the, the, the top ten, especially... You know, when you consider that compared to others who left straight away, he stuck around. He didn't move until until after winning the Copa Libertadores, of course, with Santos. He's, he's, he will probably end up as the as the all time uh, uh, you know, leader for Brazil in terms of appearances, possibly goals as well. Um, so it seems pretty extraordinary. I, I think it just kind of goes to show that even in Brazil, you know, if you don't do it for the national team or or maybe, you know, you don't. You go to PSG, it's not Barcelona or whatever. Maybe you fade from the limelight a little bit. Do you know whenever we talk about him <laughs> and we talk about his diving or his theatrics or that, oh, the amount of people that get upset. Yeah, there's a lot of Neymar. There's a lot of Neymar. But, but would you have him in the top ten? Just not in Brazil. Not at the moment. No, no. no. some great, great That's players. Incredible name. I, I think I think he's regressed a little bit since going to, since leaving Barcelona. I, I don't think he's lived up to his potential. Others, on the other hand, has been fantastic. Others, others is not the eight. Others have been really good. Listen. No, but listen, I, I, I understand and sympathise. I, I just don't think Neymar has done enough for club and certainly not enough for country.